Hey everyone, welcome to Being Classy. My name is Jessica and in this video I want to show you how to insert an image in Microsoft Word. So the first thing you need to do is navigate to the insert ribbon on the top left corner of your Microsoft Word desktop application. This is relatively the same if you're using Microsoft Word on the web or Microsoft Word on a mobile app. You're finding the insert tab. So once I have insert, you notice if I go over three areas, there is a pictures icon, which is a little mountain with the sun. If you click on that, you're going to have the option to insert a picture. Now, please note that the picture is going to be inserted wherever your cursor is. So notice my cursor is right here in the middle of the first paragraph and these keywords. Your image will be inserted there. You can move it, um, but that's where it will be inserted. So make sure you put your cursor where you want the image inserted. You can either photo browser, which was going to allow you to view some photos on your computer. The other option you can do, I'm not going to allow it right now, depending on if you're on the PC or Mac, it might be a different pop-up. The other area you can do is you can upload a picture from a file. So if you have an image on your computer saved as a file, you can upload that. You can look at different stock images available uh, to you and that will be right here within the application and you can um, look for different images and then you can select it. So I will show you how it will be inserted. I will select this flower image here. Notice I have two selected. If you'd like to unselect it, you simply need to click it again and you'll notice the blue check mark will go away. Uh, so I just want this one image selected and then I can select insert on the bottom, the blue button insert. Notice there was a one there to show that one image was being inserted. All right, so here I have my image and I can uh, make it larger or smaller um, by having my mouse go on these white corners on the end. I could make it longer, which is gonna change it. If that wasn't what I wanna do, simply go up to the top, there's a little undo arrow, or you can have a keyboard shortcut to undo. Okay, but now I, I want it to move, but notice if I highlight and I'm trying to move it over, it's not moving. So what do I need to do here? Well, you can select the image and simply right click on it um, to select the wrap text. Now, sometimes when you select the image, the wrap text button will appear and it looks up like this up here, it's the lines with the little U. That is how you are going to be able to move your image. Notice also once you insert your image, uh, you can do all different things here. You can edit it with different colors, artistic effects. You can change the transparency, a bunch of different things for another video. But if I need to move this image around, let's say I want to move it somewhere else, I can select wrap text. And then simply you could, uh, if you want to put it behind the text, then if you move it, notice it goes behind the text. Super cool. Uh, the other thing you can do, uh, let me go back here. Okay, I could select wrap text and then I could put it uh, top and bottom. So there's just a bunch of different things you can do. Notice I will do that. So you can play around with how you would best like to uh, put the image. Let's say I'd like my writing to go on the side. I could select position, which is right next to wrap text, and that is going to position it within my writing. I can move it around now. So the main thing you need to do if you want to move your image is within the, once you have inserted the picture here, there's a picture formatting. The other way you can get to that um, is by double clicking on it and then it'll show up on the right side. So you'll notice there's just a bunch of options. If you want to move it, you want to select either position, okay, um, and you can inline it with the text, uh, then you can move it, or you can select wrap text, which will allow you to move your image around. I hope this video helped you learn how to insert an image or a photo in Microsoft Word. If this video is helpful, please like this video, share it out with anyone else who may benefit from it, and don't forget to subscribe to Being Classy. My name is Jessica, and I will catch you in the next video.